Hey guys, welcome back to Minecraft, where I am stuck in the muskrat. If oh look, there's a planet there. If you remember, I am playing Space Purge, where I am head of some sort of investigative unit that has gone to find out what's wrong with this space station, where everyone seems to have just like spontaneously up and disappeared. Um, so I got there and I found a load of space zombies, which immediately aroused my suspicions, as you would imagine. Um, everything was locked down, so I had to go to engineering and start up all the systems again. Where ints? Oh look, there's a space spider there. Where ints? I got uh, access to the main access control panel thingy. Yes. Uh, which told me that this muskrat was ready for launch. So I was like, all right, let's go find out what's happening at the asteroids. Uh, and then, uh, oh, I, I raided the armory and stuff, and that's where I got better, better, better kit. Um, and, and now we seem to be outside Earth? Looks like Earth. Is that supposed to be Earth far away? The problem is, with the resolution of the blocks, I can tell that that's a small Earth up close. Terrible, right? All right, let's kill some spiders, because it's just going to get worse the more we wait. Um, I can't really get get these. Look, there's loads here. Loads and loads. Uh, the problem is, of course, that more will just keep spawning whilst I'm... Oh, oh, okay, let's run. <laughs> uh, the problem is that they've got me hemmed in, right? <laughs> this is where the strength potion probably wouldn't go amiss, right? I'm hoping... If I just kind of hide in the corner like this... Oh, just run. Run, 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 run. Maybe we can get out. Maybe we can get out. I just want. I just want to get out. Oh wow! They, sure. Oh, they can, they knocked me off. I was expecting to find something out here. It's death. Ah. Well, that didn't go well. Let's carry on. Oh, they're gone. Oh, they. Oh, really? Oh. Did did they die because I dropped too far away? Don't. Don't you dare. There's more. Okay, so I'm obviously not meant to go out there. Maybe I'm supposed to go up here. Um, go away. This is going to just get tougher and tougher, isn't it, as I wait around. I'm used to spiders being a little bit weaker than this, actually. Um, or, zo or zombies being harder. I don't know. System restart. Well, this didn't clear out any... Uh, please activate all systems first. Well, where are the systems to get activated? Let's drink our strength potion. There we go. And may maybe now we can get up on top and find out what these guys are all about. Hey. Let's kill them. Kill them all. Scumbags. So this is something that's supposed to be reset, right? Dumb. Guidance system online. Sweet. Uh, so this explains why there were uh, levers and stuff on the engines, right? Must do. Must do. Uh, there's, there's one. Oh, can't do it whilst pressing shift. I just didn't want to get swiped swiped by a fucking spider like that! Oh, well, there we go. Let's try this again. Turn around and run. Run. Kill him. Kill it quicker. Kill them quicker. Kill them quicker. It's the only way to survive. Oh, if only we could nuke them from orbit, eh? If only we could nuke them from orbit. So I've lost my strength bonus. Oh, it's actually really tough. I could do with some backup, really. So obviously, I don't think this is a single player map, really. Jeez, I mean, look at the number of those spawners. There was like six spawners down the side of that ship. What am I supposed to do there? Honestly. What I'm supposed to do is complain about it loudly. Ah, obviously. Okay, let's just jump out, throw the lever. No one cares about the spiders. Let's just knock them away just merely for... Oh, sh shoot! It's tough. It's tough, guys. I'm not. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing at this point. If, like, I literally cannot cannot fight them fast enough to be able to throw a lever. So, um, yeah, I don't. I, I don't know. I don't know. And it's not going to let me have the system restart until all the systems are restarted. Right. Just just run, just run, turn and fight. Ah! Oh. You might be able to tell from my tone of voice, I'm getting slightly vexed at this. Slightly vexed. You could, uh. Maybe, maybe what we need to do is just build up the spider population in the middle here so that no more can spawn around the outside. Maybe. 
the thing is, if I just keep fighting, there's just going to be more spiders along any second because that's how spawners work. Oh. Fudge. And all other words beginning with literally all other words beginning with F. I am. Ooh. It's not a great way to start the, start the episode. I've got to say, guys, this is this is not what I had intended. I was just like, yep, yeah, I'm just gonna just gonna fly out, see what's going on, fight a few things, and come back. I didn't realize it was gonna be all this lever throwing business. Spider fighting. The go ah! 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 I dislike this. <laughs> I dislike this a lot. Let's get out of my inventory and respawn. I don't. Ah! Uh, I just don't even like. What? What am I supposed to? What am I supposed to? There's no point killing each and every spider because literally as I kill them more are respawning. That's that's kind of how spawner boxes work, right? Uh, sounds quiet. Sounds quiet. Let's just do it quick. I need to be stop stop being so timid around around the outside. So they seem to not be spawning quite so greater numbers die. 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 A third 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 strike. Fourth strike. Oh, I could do without this. Okay, that's that done again. Where's the switch? There's the switch. No. Okay, could Is that all of them? Is that all of them? I got I got three three things to flick. I'm not sure whether that that's all of them or not. Let's go. System restart. Boom. Uh beginning total system restart. After restoring all of the system functions, you skillfully pilot the vessel to the rest of the way to the asteroid. Ooh. You search for the nine pieces of mal... Wait, what? Why am I looking for malachite? Be warned, Commander. You will not be alone. Okay. The vessel gently lands on the asteroid surface. Oh, I feel like I'm falling a long way. And oh wow! Did you hear those Endermen? I heard those Endermen. The sensors are picking up signals from inside the asteroid. Be careful! I will be careful. So have I been teleported to the end, or is this just? Hang on, let's look. One. That's my biome. I'm in. A, I'm in the plane, so I've not been teleported to the end. There just must be uh, Endermen spawners around. There's a lot of end stone. Right, wh where are we going? So Malachite looks a lot like Nether Quartz. I, I noticed this. I'm totally not sure where I'm supposed to be. I'm just kind of running around the outside of this asteroid here. Um, which, unfortunately, doesn't give me a lot to talk about. I mean, the asteroid's nice, but I've got to say, the uh, the, the end stone and the quart quartz ore don't really blend together very well. I'm not sure if they're meant to blend or what, but it doesn't do it very well, whatever it's supposed to do. Okay. Uh, not sure. Where, not sure where we're going. Perhaps it's time to stop for a picnic. Stop for a, a nice fish picnic. I say a nice fish picnic. There's no such thing as a nice fish anything. Ugh, fish. All right. So still walking around. Not. I'm a little, a little bit baffled. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here at all. This is a big rock. Whatever it is. Maybe I'm. Maybe I'm not going down far enough. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to just keep walking a bit further down each time uh, until I find somewhere that's not going to let me back up, and then we'll, we'll stop. <coughs> I think that's kind of a good plan. I mean, I can barely see the ship now. And, and, you know, you don't want to lose track of the place where you came from, right? I mean, that's just going to lead to all sorts of troubles. All sorts of troubles. Um, still massively missing anywhere to go though. Well, th there's malachite all around me. I'm not sure if this is what I'm supposed to be looking for. Oh, did you see that light? I saw that light. There's some light here. What's this light about? Hello, secret chat. Oh no. Ooh, set spawn point here. I have set the spawn point. Uh, what have we got? Uh, I know that you could jump down, but if you take a cut instead, I will tell you a story. Warning more than one person right at a time will confuse, and you wouldn't want that. Oh, look, golden apples. Take them. They're, they're nice. I'm sure I'm going to waste them somehow. We don't want the golden carrots, but we do want the steak. That can replace this fish. Uh, I'm going to take a minecart. 
Brilliant. I'm not going to replace it with my bow, though. That would be rubbish. Uh, going to pop that in there, get in there, press the button, and we're away! I should have looked over the side. Welcome to the asteroid cavern, full of clouds. This is where you will find the nine pieces of malachite that we need to power up the transporter. Oh, we, we needed some for the transporter, didn't we? Legend says that monsters guide the minerals. But you are too smart to believe in such nonsense, aren't you? Nope. I thought as much. Uh, if you were starting to believe that, I would imagine that you would also want to know that among the monsters, certain huge ones of their species served as guardians. That's nice. You may want to try and avoid them. Yes. If they existed, of course. Of course. Um... Is that it? Is that, the, is that the beautiful story that we were getting told? I hope not. You're about to reach the end of the line. Yeah, that was that was the beautiful story. That was rubbish. Um, let's try and keep our wits about us. Yeah, because, you know, I've just been kind of wandering around through this map. Okay, that's it. Without without paying attention to anything. Do you reckon I've got to get up there? Uh, no turning back now. Look, a chest. I see that chest. Let's go, let's go get that chest first, shall we? I ain't gonna make it up. Good luck! Thank you, brave narrator. You, you have inspired me to do well. Uh, so there's a lot of searching going on on this map. Malachite, there we go. Well, at least got the colour right. Awesome, look, there's another one. Awesome. Uh, how many did he say we were looking for? Nine? Six? Six or nine? Oh, I hate being so bad of memory. So this is the monsters. Monsters are suspiciously like the, spa the same space zombies that we saw in the space station. Uh, what I need to do is read through my text. And oh, whoa! It's a giant. It's a giant. Which means 1.8 would be rubbish because they would have no AI. Oh, wow, they're coming at me from everywhere. I just wanted to read this text quick. Somewhere up here. Nine pieces of malachite. Okay, well, that's... That's awkward. Okay, well let's avoid let's avoid the the giant. Well, maybe he can like come after me. Uh, come at me, bro! Oh, god, he is. No, don't, don't, please don't. I don't, I don't need you to come at me. Let's climb up here and see what's going on. See if we can fight him from the from the higher portions. Um, so I'm just going to kind of make my way in a slow, lazy circle around the edge and just just see if we can find any more chests anywhere. Um, I don't know, it's always interesting, like, trying to figure out what a search pattern... Oh, look, there we go. What a search pattern should be for this sort of place. Uh, obviously, a human has put these things down, which means he's going to be doing things in a certain order, whether he meant to or not. Unfortunately, it's all about trying to tap into that certain order, and I'm not, I'm not great at that. I'm not great at that. Uh, let's get up here, look around. Try and find... Hey... There's another chest. Great. Shame we could... Well, I should have tried to break the chest, shouldn't I? I didn't even think about it. I mean, can I? No, I'm in adventure mode. I'm in adventure mode. I can't do these things. Why would you even think that I could do these things? Hey. Hey. Okay, let's go up here. I've got a feeling this central spire should kind of be left till last. Unless we happen to spot anything on it at the time. I mean, do you reckon there's anything down this gap here? Uh, zombies, death. There's going to be death around. I think there's going to be death in quite large portions. Um, let's go back to this chest. I'm hoping that you can actually see one chest from the other, or just with the minimal amount of movement. Uh, I don't know. Let's go. Let's go check over over this way because that looks interesting. You see those? See those formations over here? Um, so we're nearly halfway. We've got four out of nine. Yeah, halfway would be a half crystal, so unfortunately we, we, we can't really... There we go, we're now over halfway. This is good, right? It's got to be good. I'm, I'm not terrible. It's not not feeling terrible. Um, but nine, nine's a lot. Nine is a lot, lot. Ooh, parkour for the win. Yeah, jump down a hole. Uh, what have we got around here? More of these. Let's check a bit further around the outside. I, do you think there's going to be any hidden under the water? I hope not. I mean, this is going to be tough enough as it is. Tough enough as it is. Nom, nom, nom. Hmm. 
<laughs> so from this perfectly spherical cave, there's, there's this slab thing running up around the outside. Seems a little bit off. A little bit off. Who knows? Who knows? Right. Mm, this middle spire really does look a bit, a bit too tempting for it to not to have anything on it. Let's just kill him. Is there another one behind me? Is he behind me? He is, but oh god. Horrible green nasty things. Hate them. I hate them. The fact that they were people once just makes it worse. They should know better. So that's a bit of glowstone. It's a bit of glowstone. Oh, I see a spawner. Is this really the range on the spawner? Wow! Did you watch it flame up and then someone appeared behind me? That is is nasty. Like nasty nasty. Let's get up the side here and see if we can spot anything. I don't know whether we will or not. Oh, <laughs> there's one right there in front of you. <laughs> Doing well. Doing well. Right, we're at six. We are officially at two thirds the way. Yeah. Um, which means we've got three more to find before we find the end of the rail track again. Which I think we should be able to do. This doesn't sound too difficult. Um, I am ridiculously unobservant though so I, I like for all i know i could have already spotted all nine chests and just kind of glossed over it where i'm trying to pay attention to what's going on around uh well pay attention to what's going, coming out of my mouth rather than what's going on around me which is a little bit annoying and and still do you hear the things that come out of my mouth it's ridiculous right it's ridiculous okay there's there's chest number seven i'm wondering whether there's another bit up there uh i don't know it's quite nice uh it all being laid out in a nice nice round uh what's the what's the thing I'm looking for here? Circular circular pattern here. Let's let's piss off that uh giant, shall we? Ha 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 He can't even see Ooh. Oh his little brother's coming to have me. His baby brother, I suppose. Not a little brother, is uh, the normal one's a little brother. Wow, how many there we go. And now we now we shoot him. Did anyone keep count of how many arrows it took to kill that, that giant? Uh, that was that was pretty intense right there. There was a lot of arrows fired all the way across the across the cavern. Uh, right, I feel like I feel like I want to check around the back side of this because you know I like checking back sides out. I mean, who doesn't? Honestly, who doesn't? I suppose a few of the uh, the more die-hard Christians out there they they probably have uh, one or two reservations about it. But I suppose that's their loss. Though I suppose they're going to say that the uh, the, ch the missed chance of eternal life is my loss. So uh, I suppose we're about even there. Okay, what have we got up here? Up, up, up. I, do I, I don't know if I'm supposed to be going up here. I just kind of, I saw a path to jump up and so I felt compelled to jump up it. Uh, over there is where the minecart came down. So we must be getting roughly towards the end of the loop, which is good because we only need to find two more. And I'm guessing at least one of them is going to be in this central spire somewhere. Hopefully. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Mainly excuse me for that being so weak and terrible. That was a bit bit foamy. A bit foamy. Alright, this search is starting to take a bit long now. The only thing I really have to talk about is how foamy my burps is. And that's, that's just a bit rubbish, isn't it? Um... Uh, I could I could really do with a bit of a clue as to where these last couple of bits are. I I honestly don't know. I honestly don't know. Um, and this water doesn't help. This water is making it a lot slower than it needs to be. Um, I do wonder if I missed anything between that spire and here where I went round the outside. So let's try and let's try and keep out of the water because the water's bad. Hey, Mr. Zumbles. This looks like a path, like an actual path. Do you think this is actually a path, or do you think it's just somewhere that's kind of an accident of the way it got formed? I don't know. I don't know. Does mean that there's a. Oh, wow, look at them all. Look at them all. Does mean this is a nice, uh, safe area, though. Just stand here and, and kill the zombies that come at me. Uh, it's not really helping me find the Malachite, though. Not really helping me find the Malachite though. 
I could spend all day trying to like parkour my way up here. That's another another chest there. Did you see it? I saw it. There's another chest there. And we're missing just one final chest. One final chest. Now you can go get the last piece of malachite. It's located at the top of the largest stalagmite. All right, well, let's do that. Make sure you have all of the first eight pieces of malachite before you make your way up the top. Uh, I opened up a doorway somewhere along the base of it. Uh, if you're scared of heights, you may want to avoid looking down. Why did I walk back towards the horde? Whose clever idea was this? I'm now in the middle of them all. Okay, so we're just going to kind of go around the base looking for other pathways up, right? Let me just... Oh, they're, they're spawning right in front of me here. That's no good. Uh, I, how am I supposed to recognise a doorway as opposed to just a bit of a slanty bit like we had over there? Uh, I'm not entirely sure. I, I would like to see, like, I don't know, a stone brick stairway. That, that would let me know for definite that it's not the bit we're looking for. That is the bit we're looking for. Sorry. <laughs> not is yeah it's all relative <laughs> honest okay up there maybe is this no this doesn't no 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 oh out bing bang walla walla bing bang uh what we got up here we got death well we got a giant over there giants aren't particularly aren't particularly much of a trouble at the moment um Mainly because this this landscape is just so tight in for them. This is it. This is this where I'm supposed to be going? Uh, this also looks like it's just a jump away. That's, that's bad. That's terrible. Well, I think we're gonna have to find it next episode, guys, because I'm gonna have to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure. Uh, it's been relatively insightful i suppose how do how do people hide their chests well they hide them around in a great big circle uh next time we'll be finding the way up here i i, I honestly do not know um I, yeah. and possibly fighting off more zombie hordes yeah but i will see you then when we're gonna do that because i'm definitely gonna survive this oh jeez. bye <laughs>